Today I'm going to talk about the question of what is considered a probation violation in probation. There are two general categories of probation violations in Pennsylvania, technical violations and new criminal offenses. Depending on the terms of your proba probation, technical violations uh, can vary. Almost any new criminal charge though, including a summary uh, offense and relatively minor misdemeanor offenses are also probation violations. Uh, here at my firm, we can help you understand what is considered a probation violation in Pennsylvania. Uh, give us a call for a free uh, consultation. You can set one up and a probation violation uh, lawyer will speak with you. What is a technical uh, probation violation in Pennsylvania? These occur when you violate the terms and conditions uh, that the judge put on your proba probation agreement. The probation is an agreement that you will abide by certain terms if the court allows you to remain under probationary supervision instead of sending you to jail. The ways you get a technical violation, violation uh, vary depending on the terms of your probation, but uh, some of the most common violations uh, stem from the following. It can be failing to contact your probation officer is scheduled, failing a drug test, uh, not notifying your probation officer about a move or a job change, uh, quitting your job or leaving school, failing to complete mandatory drug uh, or alcohol counseling, and failing to pay fines or restitution. Now, what if you commit another crime while on probation? If you violate your probation by committing another crime, your probation can arrest you immediately and oftentimes, almost without exception, they do. If this occurs, state law guarantees that uh, you have the right to a probation violation hearing within two days. You also have the right to have an attorney present uh, with you during that hearing. Following your hearing, the judge can mod modify your probation, add stricter terms, or revoke uh, the remainder of your probation and keep you in jail. Uh, committing any criminal act violates your probation agreement. Even minor offenses can lead to serious consequences if you are uh, already on probation for a previous conviction. This is true even if you committed uh, two unrelated crimes. For example, if you are on probation after a drug possession arrest and now uh, face uh, theft charges, you will still probably go in front of a judge for a hearing. Uh, we can represent you in court for a probation violation appearance as well as defend you if the district attorney pursues additional uh, criminal charges against you. That's something that we routinely do here at my firm. Uh, you may also face a probation violation hearing simply because police accuse you of a second crime. If this occurs in your case, we can present a strong defense on your behalf during your hearing and argue uh, to the judge that he, he or she should not take action until there is a conviction uh, in your other case, if there ever is one. Another question, what are the consequences of a violation? The judge has a lot of discretion when it comes to the type of penalties you will face after a violation. In most cases, the judge will consider a number of factors uh, before making uh, a decision such as the, the following, um, the nature of your violation, the seriousness, seriousness excuse me, of your new crime or technical violation, and if this is your first violation or you've had previous probation violations, that is often a, a big factor. While the judge could revoke your probation for any violation, we can often argue for modification in terms or another penalty altogether instead. Uh, after we review the facts of your case, we'll have a better idea, of course, of the type of consequences uh, you may expect uh, if we can prove you did not violate your probation. Um, some possible outcomes uh, of a violation include the following. Revocation of your probation, meaning you will serve out your original sentence in jail, probation, revocation, and another sentence up to the legal maximum for your original crime, mandatory enrollment in a drug rehabilitative uh, program or other court-ordered counseling, extension of your probation sentence, an order to perform community service, 
and or a modification of the terms of your probation. Depending on the outcome of your hearing, you could face devastating consequences that affect all aspects of your life, unfortunately. If you go to jail for even a, a few weeks, obviously you can lose your job or have to drop out of school, uh, miss paying bills even. Uh, you will certainly suffer as will uh, your family. Uh, how can you talk to a Pennsylvania probation violation lawyer today? Well, that's easy. Uh, if you have to go uh, before a judge during a revocation hearing, you need someone who can stand by your side, who knows the system, who knows the judges, and can offer support and guidance. When you enlist my help um, and my criminal defense team here at my firm, we will fight to minimize the potential penalties you face and work to get your life back to normal as soon as humanly possible. Call us today at 610-991-7219 and let us review your case.